hello and lovelies welcome back to my channel Gladys here today I will be sharing with you and reviewing my Louis Vuitton mini Palm Spring backpack I will be sharing with you some details about this bag what fits inside and styles how you can wear the bag so to proceed let's start shall we first I got this bag for eight months now and I got this bag early this year which is February me and my mom went to the Louis Vuitton boutique and my mom got the chance to grab the Louis Vuitton you know way she got the same color combination and in same canvas and me I got lucky that when I went to the store when I called they got stock for this little guy right here because we all know that this guy was so in hype like the range are very very crazy you know people are wanting this bag this bag so much so that's the little story about it and this bag really amazed me it really amazed me how this bag can fit a lot of stuff you know yes it is in a mini size and you can see that probably what can I fit in this little bag but hey I'm telling you this fits so much more than your essentials and that makes me more love this bag and every day when I started using it I keep loving it every day that I don't change my bag for two consecutive months yes imagine that two consecutive months that I'm just wearing this little guy right here and even a simple outfit while wearing this bag will gonna make you look cool or cute and every time I wear this bag I got a lot of compliments actually you know you can wear this with just jeans sneakers and then a tank top or a crop top and then you'll still look look cute you know like in short this bag can spice up your outfit you know you can this bag can make your outfit look so cool and and you know like you're always been pulled together even though this is a backpack but since it's a mini size it's it's cute like it's gonna it's kind of like playful you know it it's been the fun in your outfit so for the size reference or size measurement for the front height it's seven inches for the back height from here to the end it's 8.5 inches for the weed it's four inches and for the wide it's six inches and for the details in front of the bag I have you it has the small front pocket and it has the black leather tag here where it says Louis Vuitton and you got the gold zipper pull and you got this two little leather tab here also in black and the strap as well is in black lining black leather and also for the top handle it's black I, I've heard that this is made out of lambskin I'm not sure about that <laughs> so this bag comes in three straps one two and then there's a shorter one which you can connect to each of the strap to make it longer it it varies on the style how you are gonna wear the bag because this bag can be worn in four different styles one I mean first is like a handbag like you're gonna have the short strap connected to here and here and it's gonna kind of like looping you know but when I tried it on I don't recommend you guys wearing the bag in in that way <laughs> the clock is ringing and sorry about the noise <laughs> all right so that's the first style but i don't like i said i don't recommend uh wearing the bag the bag like that because it's so bulky under your arm like the bag is sitting like that like that 
that's no fun at all <laughs> right and the second way how to wear the bag is cross body which is i'll see hopefully i can show it to you quickly without taking much of the time all right since i am petite i don't need the connection strap which is but if you're in a taller side probably you will be needing that if you want to use the bag as a crossbody but for me since i'm very 58 five foot one one strap is enough for me to make the bag crossbody so you're gonna take the strap from being in a backpack style and then hook the clasp here and here show it to you see where it hits it just hit right on top of my hip which is perfect I can easily grab the um, zipper to open it you know it's not too long for me wearing it crossbody but since I got this bag I don't use this as I don't wear it as a crossbody. There are only two ways that I love using this bag, which is the backpack style and handheld. I hold this top handle and I just carry it like this. That I'm not a fan of using this as a crossbody bag and a handbag. So like I said, if you are in the taller side then probably you needed that that um connection strap to find the perfect length for this for this bag and i only found two wares for this bag since i have it but before i jump into that i will guide you more for the I'll show you more about this uh, bag like the details and everything and inside so like it has a front pocket here a tag and a two letter tag here too and it has the gold zipper lining and for the back you had that putted kilted lining here all the way to the end of the bag so there's no foot there's no stud And at the side so I think this is a uh, one two three three piece of monogram canvas so this is not a one piece continuous monogram canvas this is made out of three monogram canvas one two and three so for the inside of the bag I've heard also that others have trouble opening or unzipping the bag but for me since see I can do it very good or very easily it glides very smoothly but for me I prepare footing also a charm so I have my charm here my key charm this is from Burberry there and I have my key charm from LB as well so this is what I'm currently using right now I will connect it to the zipper pull there because since the zipper is very small to hold on to I'd like to have it with a charm and I can easily access the bag and open it unzip it and zip it since the bag is empty I'm kind of having a little bit trouble about it there. so and when you open the bag you will see the black interior lining and it's nylon and there's one open pocket over here and it has the tag at the back where the bag is made of I think mine is made in Spain 
and over to the um i think it's over here to the right hand side when you're facing the back you can see um the date code on the right side but but right now since i'm facing to you guys it's on the left side but you're, if you're facing to the bag like this you're gonna find the date code of the bag on the right side inside the open pocket and this and it's an open compartment like that nothing anymore no more pockets or something and like i said earlier you can fit tons more than of your everyday essential in this bag as long as you pack it properly and you know be wise on bringing of things that you really need it so I'm gonna close it again and here is the bag this is an eight month old Louis Vuitton mini Palm Spring backpack here is the side again the back the bottom and the other side this bag I really do recommend to you ladies to have it you know don't hesitate you know don't hesitate to have this baby on your collection because I said this is very versatile bag it will suit to your lifestyle but and it fits on your wardrobe it will matches all of your outfit you can wear this with dress with shorts with with sweater or hoodie or or a dress or or a skinny jeans or shorts you know everything this bag will outstand your outfit like I said and let's go and talk about the wear and tear of this bag since I have this bag for eight months now and I've been using it a tons of times there are only two issues that I've been seeing for the past eight months for this little guy. First is the first is this two letter tab here where this deering is attached, you know. You can see there are some fraying on the letter and I know some of the owners of the mini palm spring backpack does the same way too there does it bother me at all no because for me it's part of me wearing the bag you know it's part of the wear of the bag like I know for some time you know this something's gonna change in this backpack like we cannot preserve it especially when we're using it expect that there are gonna be some changes or wear and tears right so that doesn't bother me at all showing you again there and on the other side but for the other top those two here I don't see any fraying on the letter see none only these two bottom parts and for the second um, issue that I've seen for having this bug is the strap this part this is where you hook into the bottom during here there and what I noticed about it after quite some time is look at all these linings here of the leather and there's some discoloration on the glazing there you can see and to the other side as well the other strap You see that gold thing over here on the side and on the other side and it has this cringe or lining from the leather but 
like I said, it's not bothering me because it's part of me using the bag. You know, it's part of the wear and tear. And for the hardware, I don't have any problems. It's still in a nice gold shiny hardware, even on the clasp. not making there. there you go and the leather strap is still in good condition like I how I got it and since I don't change the length setting of the strap there's only changes in one hole which is this part you know let's expect that when we always change and the setting of the line of the strap the holes are kind of like gonna loosen up because here are the other holes that i don't use that i don't use there. they're still tight not unlike this one, it gets bigger and loosen. So, which is I like because I can easily um, lock it. You know, there. See, before it really gives me a hard time. Like it's, I struggle a little bit to to connect or put this little stud here into the hole because the hole are too tight. See, I have to put some pressure on it. But now that I used the bag for quite some time, it loosened up and it's easy to put the stud on the hole. So that's the only two main issues I've seen about this bag. And after all, like I said, this bag is perfect. I love it. I love it to death that probably from out of my bag, I will reach into this most of the time i've been actually missing this more than my other bag if i don't use it i don't use my bag all the time like i mean i don't i don't change bag all the time or every week especially that i know i'm being biased right i have to be fair with all my bags well i, ha I don't have that much but that's how I am, you know, because I have a very basic life. Work, house, work, house. <laughs> so I don't have sometimes much time to change the bag. And also, I want to show you guys um, where it hits when I'm using this as a backpack. So if you could see, it's sitting perfectly right on top of my butt and it moves a little bit but it's fine I like it that way or sometimes you can also I also wear it just like that just one strap around my shoulder that and here it is for the side when I'm using it as a backpack there see it hits perfectly like I said I don't use the shorter strap much often because the length of the nor the strap are perfect for my size and my height so now I will be showing you what can fit into this bag so lovelies right now I will be sharing you what fits inside the bag or how I pack or what are my everyday essentials so first i'll be starting off with my chanel compact powder and now we'll put it on the side that not standing up come on 
then my next one will be my Louis Vuitton imprint leather card holder and I use this as my wallet I love this the combination this was my hubby's gift for me and also my six key holder I've used it to death this is in rose ballerine as my car key my house key I want to go to Louis Vuitton and check if they could fix this for me so that's that next also I always bring sunglasses with me and right now I have the Celine sunglasses and this is in Karen just how ah, my ring light is showing yeah so this is the Catherine's and glasses usually I don't bring the case I leave the case inside my inside my car but for the reference for you guys so whenever I bring the case I put it in the middle in standing position or like twice and then since I'm using my phone for filming let's say this case or iPhone folio case is my phone and this is from Louis Vuitton as well has the interior lining see it's dirty because I've used this so much to death as well and I don't mind that it gets dirty so I put my phone like that this is how I packed it whenever I have the case and glasses inside the bag and I have this little pouch right here from Kate Spade and this is my catch-all pouch it has the tissue blotting paper headset all tangled and two lip products I always carry this Dior lip uh, attic lipstick I use this as my lip lip balm I don't use this as a lipstick because this lipstick is so moisturizing which is what I needed and this is in shade 266 delight so that's that and I use an uh, I have another um, lip product with me whatever I'm using on my lips I bring that as well and this one is in Tom Ford which is the one I'm using right now and it's in shade pink tis I love this and lastly inside this little pouch is my Travelu. this is my perfume atomizer and right now I'm in halfway it has the Chanel Gabrielle perfume I'm loving it so let's put it back I put I use this pouch for the catch-all so every small items are in just one pouch and everything are together when I needed them I'll put it in here. There. There you go. That's how I pack my Louis Vuitton mini palm trim backpack. Glasses case is blocking the zipper, so I got my compact powder, my wallet, sunglasses, phone, car key, house key, and my essentials my lipstick, lip product, perfume, tissue. So that's that. And usually, I don't put my phone in here, and if I don't bring the sunglasses case, usually. When I don't wear the sunglasses, I'm just gonna slide it in here, right there. And also for my phone, I always have my phone in my hand. So, and if there's a time that I don't want to use it and I want to put it in my bag, I'm just gonna slide it like here in the front as well. 
or yeah like that so i can just easily grab it and this sunglasses will just gonna sit on top there see that's the other way how i pack my louis vuitton mini backpack and if i don't you can also fit i think a So if the sunglasses are not here and the phone case, I think you can still put some passport or an agenda. It still fits here. Also, an Emily full-size wallet fits here because I think Emily wallet has the same length with this one with for the height of the bag, which is the 8 inches. So this Emily full-size wallet will fit here like how I pack the, um, how I put the sunglasses inside, which is standing up like that. And also, if I'm wearing the sunglasses, I can still put a blush on and kabuki. This is from Dior and this is from Hourglass. So I can still insert some in there. See? And the kabuki, and you still have plenty of room here. See that? Plenty of room here and on top. So, like I said, this bag is pretty amazing. How there's a lot of stuff that you can fit in. Also, if you want a mint, I always bring my mint, I forgot to insert that. Okay, to include that. If I'm wearing my sunglasses, oops, or if I don't bring the case, and I'm just gonna slide the phone like that. I'm just gonna slide the phone. It sits there perfectly. still a bunch of space for this bag even though it's a mini size as long as you know how to do compact and bring the only stuff that you needed you know wisely and so yeah that fits inside my mini palm spring backpack you know card holder Couch with my lipstick, perfume atomizer, phone, sunglasses, kabuki, mint, compact powder, and a wallet and a blush. In. So that's those stuff you could put inside this bag but like i said we all have our own preferences of what things we have to bring but this is just the example for me which is what i usually need so thank you dolls and i hope you like it so now i've now that i've been covered the measurement and the styles of how you can wear this bag and how it hits onto my body whenever I wear it in different style and also what fits inside. I hope I help you dolls and lovelies to make you decide and make up your mind when you're contemplating whether you're gonna get this bag and hopefully like I said everything that I told you and everything that I feature make you decide and pull the trigger and grab the baby and add this to your collection thank you dolls for watching and i will be seeing you on my next video please hit the like and subscribe button